Hey, this is Matt from Mastery Music, and this week we've been going over a lot of pedal boards recently. And I decided to uh, bring out mine and show you what uh, I went for. Going for a practice travel board, uh, something where I could easily access the internet, look at YouTube, uh, bring up Songster, or just bring up iTunes in general, and uh, play along with the with the music, learn new stuff, and bring up Tablitur on the internet. So um, I started out with the pedal train mini board and uh, I actually uh, took a iPad clamp stand that I found at a hardware store and uh, took it apart. Uh, then I uh, made a custom little point right here so I could attach it to the board and started basically from there. Uh, next we've got the Voodoo Labs Power Pedal Plus 2 and uh, it's basically powering all my boards and even my iPad at this point. So with this setup, what I like to do is change out the first pedal from fuzz to distortion, overdrive, basically anything extra for a lead sound that I might want. Uh, then it goes into this JHS Super Bowl, and I'm basically using that as a preamp to uh, this little headphone amp that I have that's built into the board as well. Uh, I usually keep it on at all times and just adjust the knobs based on uh, what kind of tone I'm looking for or what kind of song I'm listening to. Next it goes into the new Strymon Flint, so I have a little bit of reverb and tremolo, and then it goes into a loop station, it's Boss RC3. And the reason why I picked this one is because it size and functionality, and the biggest plus for me was it had an auxiliary in. So that means iPad, any kind of tablet, MP3 player, phone, whatever, anything you've got with music on there, it will play through the loop station and then in turn go through either amplifier or this little guy, it's a head, uh, Electro Harmonics headphone amplifier and you can just plug in your headphones through there. Uh, really cool little piece of gear that I got recently through the store. All right guys, I'll, uh, I'll turn this on and let you guys hear it. Um, right now we're playing through uh, a tungsten mosaic. It's upgraded to a 12 inch speaker and running the 6L6, uh, making it around 9 watts. Uh, I've got it turned down a little bit. Going to control most of the volume with my guitar. Uh, this is a Don Grosh Electrojet. And uh, here we go. Now you guys have uh, heard it through the amp, I'm going to go ahead and hook it up to how I usually have it set up at home. Uh, right now, all the pedals are in the exact same chain except now the loop station, instead of going into the amplifier, is going into this headphone uh, preamp right here. Uh, headphones come out through here, and now I can turn on the iPad, bring up any kind of uh, media that I want, and I just... Uh, just play. Everything comes in really nice and clear. There's no distortion or any effects on the iPad since it goes into the last of the loop of where the loop station is. So uh, there you go. If you guys have any questions at all about any of the products you've seen in this video, please give us a call or email at masteryatmusic.com. Thanks a lot.